A moment of silence. Flags at half staff. Today, we remember the 17 lives lost at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School four years ago. It was a heartbreaking day for our state, a heartbreaking day for our country, and it has led to big changes in our schools. Our Liz Crawford is back now, and Liz, that mass shooting had law enforcement and school leaders rethinking security measures. Yeah, you know, immediately following the Parkland shooting, Florida lawmakers passed the Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School Public Safety Act aimed at making campuses more secure and keeping guns away from dangerous people. Now, another layer was added in 2020 with Alyssa's, Alyssa's law requiring every school to have a panic button system. It allows staff to silently alert law enforcement if there's any emergency. The law was named after one of the students killed in the shooting. Now, people in Florida also have access to a tool known as Fortify Florida. It's best known as an app. It launched in 2018 and it allows anyone to anonymously report any possible Possible danger at a Florida school. Now, as we remember the lives lost, we're also following the sentencing trial of confessed killer Nicholas Cruz. Coming up at six o'clock, we're looking at the likelihood Cruz gets the death penalty.